Hi guys, it is your boy Zippy Gaming once again. In today's video, this is my first GTA 5 video on this channel. So, in today's video, what I'm going to be showing you is a few ways of getting quick money in GTA 5. There's not lots and lots, I guess, it's not like a good few hundred K, but if you're one of those people that's just starting out, you know, you want to get some money or you're struggling with money and need to get a little bit of money on you to do stuff or move on and get more this would be a best way to do it so without any further ado let's get straight in today's video so in today's video what you want to be doing or what I'm going to be showing you is a few locations that you are able to get um, some cars that are good for selling around about 10 to 15 K each one of them you are gonna need the Sentinel vehicle I will show you what car that is in this video so first location you're gonna be going to on this game is where one of the or three of the locations that I'm gonna be showing you is gang member vehicles now these vehicles are pretty easy if you don't want to sell them they don't have to just put them into your um, garage they are very very um, hard to find you only get a few at certain periods of, or certain periods in the day the first one I'm just taking a long way around oh my god first one is around here so there will be either some parts in that car park right there Another one will be right in that same car park and there'll be some park in this car park here. If they don't park or if you don't see any at the current time, just go down the road, just go just go a fair bit of distance away, make a U-turn and come back and see if they are there. Now I'm gonna talk about something that's been happening quite a lot recently. So obviously each patch that goes on throughout GTA 5 there's more people from the GTA 5 forums and GTA 5 community finding duplication glitches and money glitches now although these glitches are good and they get you fair bits of money they can actually get your account banned now it's either a rock doll ban your account for a certain periods of time or what they will do is they will just remove all the money that you have just earned from doing that glitch and they will take it out of your bank account and you will be left with zero so in my opinion do not do duplication glitches if you don't want your account to get banned or anything like that because they are just a waste of time and if you spend the money then it will pop a red flag in the rockstar word documents and stuff like that in their forums and it will show up saying that you have done it will show that you have got a lot of money in a short period of time <clears throat> a lot of money in a short period of time and they will red flag it, it will come up immediately as a red flag they will re go through it, they will open up or whatever they do and they will go through the process and they will check that you have been or they check how you've got the money if they see that you've been duplicating cars constantly or you've been selling the same cars by duplication glitch they will just turn around go onto your account settings and just see when you remove the money straight off your account so i recommend not doing duplication glitches right so now i've said all that let's get back into finding these quick and easy ways of trying to get money so the first way is the car park now I'm trying to go around the block a few times and I've got a fair bit of distance away to try and make the cars spawn now gang cars they aren't very popular in this game but when you find one that people will realise that it's a good car and not many people actually have them they may have ones that look like it not ones that are from the actual gangs themselves now I'm going to put, put the note in now I don't believe the number plates are customly made I think they're just default number plates I'm not sure but these cars do have customizations done to these vehicles they would normally cost you money and not a lot of money but 
for probably about a few two three grand but they are good for having in your garage and showing off to your friends so these are hard to find now by the looks of it this one doesn't want to spawn at all by the looks of it no so if you want to find this game car that i'm currently trying to get but will not spawn you want to come to this parking lot right here this one on the corner or you want to go to the center car park right here in the center of this flatted area of flats and another parking area is this block here this car park center here so that is going to be for the first location of where these vehicles are found right here in this area so now i'm changing the first location i'm going to pop I'm going to go you to the second location, I'll be back in two seconds, I'm going to go to the second location and I'm going to show you guys the second vehicle or vehicles that you can get for quick and easy cash. Right, so this is... Sorry, my phone's dry. Anyway, this is the second location of where you can find another gang vehicle within GTA 5. Now each of these cars go between 10 to 15k. Now this gang car is a perfect gang car. Now you can even get the Manana or the Manana. I'm not quite sure how it is said. Or you can get a Buccaneer, I believe. Now this vehicle is purple. Obviously this is part of the purple gang. I've had this car a few times, but this is one of the cars that I can just never get to spawn throughout GTA 5. I don't know why I can never get this car to physically spawn over me to drive it. I've only had it done once or twice throughout the whole game, but some people are more lucky than others. And if you are watching this and you're in this vehicle, you'll probably more likely get it get it to pop up than I will. Uh, this vehicle, like I said, is very good, very hard to find, but it's a really nice car if you can find it with a Manana or the Manana or the Buccaneer. These two vehicles so nice in colour, so nicely done and upgraded but these cars are already customised as well so that is the second location or this is the second location this circular bit like the area from San Andreas that circular bit there and you can actually find them rolling up this road sometimes not all the time same with the uh, ones being parked so that's going to be it for the second location I'm going to show you another location right now of where to get quick and easy money in GTA 5. So guys, this is the third location of where you can get the other or the final gang car in GTA 5. Now this car I believe is a tornado. This car is nice as well, it's a nice green colour. Um, you can find it anywhere up this road. You can sometimes find it parked down the alleyway on the left there but you can normally find it down this road somewhere going up and down or parked on the side of the road on this corner somewhere now this car is the same as the others it sells between 10 and 15k and it is good to also show around with your mates if you want to keep this car as well now as you can see i haven't managed to get any of the three cars to spawn are the gang members but what i will do at the end of this video is i will show you each and every car that i can get to i'll show you each and every car and what they look like within gta 5 if i show a video if i show you part of one of the gang crew's cars and there's one one of the cars that or there's two different cars and i haven't shown the other one in the in this video it's because i haven't managed to get the vehicles to spawn at all but what I will do is I will input in next next time videos or in later on videos. I will show you I will show you the um, the cars that I am showing in this video. I will show in those videos. So yeah, this is the second, this third location of where you can find. There it is. There you go. There is the green tornado. I've just managed to make it spawn. I'm gonna try and take this without dying at least. Please don't shoot me, I beg. So this is the green tornado that you can find. This is the gang vehicle. 
What holders? I'll go to a better area so you can see it properly. Give me two seconds. Mm. Body scratched it. I'm running out for, for a minute. And body scratched it. Jesus Christ. But anyway, this is the Manana. Not the Manana. The Tornado. And I've just been put bounds on me. This is the Tornado. Now this. I know um, these cars won't be very fast in speed. But these cars are good to just drive around with. Have a bit of fun. Have a bit of, uh, you know, a bit of a banner with your mates. And just chill. If you're one of those guys that's just looking for constant speed, then this, this, none of these vehicles are for you. I'm just telling you this now. None of these vehicles will be good for you. If you're looking for quick and easy cash, or you want a car that you can roll around in, you know, chew with your mates and stuff like that, these are some of the cars that I would recommend without you paying and that have customizations on them. So this is the Tornado. Now, this vehicle is... Uh, this vehicle is a good vehicle. I do. I will like. I would say that this vehicle is pretty good. It does show a lot of features that uh, some cars don't, or most cars don't. But unfortunately, yes, this looks like a hard top. You can't actually take the. Uh, no, the the looks like a convertible, but you can't take the convertible bit down for some reason. I don't know why. I've tried, but I just haven't made it to work. So this is the tornado uh the green i think the ballers i think this uh this car is out of the gangs i think there's ballers Ve vegas Va vargos i think i don't know i've got all three games i haven't played story in a long time but this is the ballers car i believe and yeah it's pretty nice i do like it not my go-to vehicle if i was going to chill around with my mate so but it's better off than spending 15, 20k on a car that just doesn't look good and doesn't like, you know, go around and make some chill for a bit. So it just doesn't have that speed in my opinion, but it's a good car, I do like it. What I'm going to do, I'm going to call my vehicle back up and I will show you another location for, oh, for more cash in GTA 5. So I'll be back. So guys, this will be the fourth location, I believe, the fourth vehicle I'm showing you in this video. Now, for this one, you're gonna need this car, not customized, obviously, just a normal, normal version. If you don't have a customized one, if you do, then drive this or drive this, drive the car that I'm in. And what you want to do is you want to ride or drive actually from probably this road here this main road here all the way down to about here and then go down and do a u-turn back all the way around the reason i'm saying this is because when you drive this car down there when you drive a sentinel a default sentinel or a custom message or any sentinel that you've got or you picked up from the game if you drive down this road thank you so much now i'm almost at the road or i'm on the road but i'm close to it but as you drive down here what will happen is recommend going a bit slow just taking your time a bit just last few times i've dropped rushing this the car just hasn't spawned and these you want to just drive slow all the way down this road and what you want to do is if you get to this road here on this junction here this junction bit here there another sentinel of this car because i found that this is one of the cars that i found off of that um, junction but if you get sentinel and you drive around the block if you guys have a road and it's not there go down the road drive around the block all the way and what you do is as you go back up here you will see um you'll come up to the junction you were just at now by the looks of it yep there it is that is the yellow version of this car this is the second sentinel 
that purple one right there is the first one or this is the other one compared to that one now that one is purple this one is like a yellowy green they're both the exact same they've got different customizations obviously but both but they are similar um, they're not the convertible one unfortunately but they are normal cars now the, this car preferably is very good for just mucking around trying to you know, piss back with your friends hug it the laugh and you can actually get some really really nice customizations on this car you can make this car look pretty nice so if you're one of those people that's just looking to just pick up a car go and customize it go and customize it make it look nice and then show up in your garage this is one of the cars that i'd recommend upgrading one because you can find it and two because you can buy this car but what's the point in buying it when you can just find it and the customi customizations on this car are actually quite cheap obviously the turbo and that are going to be like 30k or 50k or something this is sport but this is a thing to me this car is such a good car i like i love driving this car you know it's got a nice roar to it it's got a nice look to it obviously the orange or the yellowy color that is on the car doesn't really suit it as much in my opinion but a normal bright yellow would stand out perfectly on this car now what i'm going to do now is i'm going to go around i'm going to find two of the four two out of the four cars that i didn't show you at the very beginning of this video so what i'm going to do is obviously you can actually sell this car this car goes for 10 to 15k again this is a pretty pretty uh, decent car but it does have some speed to it it's not up there in the sports cars or the future cars in my opinion so not really in my opinion but my thoughts but this car is just overall brilliant you can do all sorts of this car it's a really nice car i do like driving it what i'm going to do now is i'm going to actually sell it and show the actual price for this vehicle so go down to sell this car sells for 15k now I'm, gonna, I'm not going to sell it, I'm going to keep it so if you do any upgrades to it, it may differ the price so look, I'm going to do is I'm going to put a roll cage on it now as you see, the price has gone up but sometimes a certain customization, customization can decrease the price so just be wary of that but anyway, this car is a great car, I love it it is all around the best car to find and customise and my friend in what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna show you the two other vehicles the first spot I showed you and the second spot I'm gonna go and find those two vehicles and put them in the video when I find them so you guys can see what the cars also look like so guys that is gonna be it the four spots I'm gonna show you right now the four of the two vehicles that I didn't show you the yellow gang car and the purple gang car I'm going to go and get them and show you what they look like and they are pretty nice as well I do like them I hope you do as well and always guys if you need a little bit of money or you want to go and pick up some quick cash this is the best way to do it in my opinion instead of backing up missions after missions and just getting about 15 20 days time and you can find a vehicle and sell it and get it for about 30 days or two of them at least if so true you could get about 20 to 30 k if you sell if you manage to pick all four up you're looking probably 40 to 60 k in cash that's pretty high in my opinion that's decent as well in my opinion so anyway guys i'm going to show you these last two cards i didn't show you at the beginning of this video i hope you did enjoy see you in two minutes hi guys i am back now this is the first location that i showed you on the map and this location is the yellow vehicle 
now as we come around here there you go there is two of them right there that is the butt of near now this vehicle is very very popular on the streets of ls i've only managed to find a few of them before there's not many of us out there now what i'm going to do i'm going to act like that i'm chilling you know i'm part of just acting like i'm part of the gang but i'm actually not i'm gonna chore this car now as you see as you go to chore this car you will get all of these gang members shooting at you now in my opinion you don't want that happening you want to pull back a bit you want to find some cover and what you want to do is you want to pull out a gun any gun doesn't matter and you want to cap them all if you want to keep the car clean and fresh if you want to repair it and go to the repairs or my truck and get it repaired you can do that but in my opinion that's just wasting a few hundred dollars which you could save some of those few hundred dollars for a later part in the game yes i know it's not a lot and it's only a little, little bit of money but that little hundred dollars can be a big difference for a price later in the game but what i'm going to do is just because of this video i'm not going to go for the gang i'm just going to jump in the car and blow it and drive away as you see i'm going to do it right now go for it now you will die, you probably may die once or twice, but that is fine because when they come to you, they come for you, there's nothing much you can do about it. In my opinion, try not to die though because you may lose the car if you spawn a long distance like I just have. Is the car still there? I'm hoping it is, please. Is the car still here? Yes, the car is still here. Now. That one is the broken one, I'm going to get this fresh one. And apparently Simeon wants this vehicle, which I'm not sending it to him. But there you go, that is the yellow car out of the yellow gang member crew area. Now there is a few locations around the map that you can actually get the yellow gang area to come for you. That is the yellow car gang car that I'm showing you now. In this video, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go and try and get the second vehicle or the second spot that I showed you in this video. I'm going to try and get that car spawned. If I can't, I will let you know in a minute. But if not, or if I do get spawned, I will show you this car because out of all of them, this car looks so nice and so clean. It's one of the cars that I love just picking up, driving around, having a bit of fun in and just having a laugh in because this car is very very nice i do like it but what i'm going to do is i'm going to go and find a vehicle after i've lost the police when i get it i will show you see you in okay guys we are just doing a rotation off to the second location of where we saw the or we tried to see the purple car it did not spawn whilst we were here so we'll just double check and go on the third look to see if it has spawned or not. If I look, I'm just going to do a quick look around the block because uh, sometimes the gang members can actually take the car and drive off with it. Okay, so let's just go up here and let's go right in here. <coughs> let's go right here. What we're trying to do is we're trying to, we're trying to get the gang to respawn, we're trying to get that car to respawn. Uh, trying to make it automatically spawn out and it turns off by the time we get there, by the time we turn that left, hopefully that car should spawn. Now I'm going to look back behind here, hopefully it should spawn. And it hasn't spawned at all. Alright, now. What I'm going to try do is I'm going to try one more around the block. I'm going to around it around the block. See if I can get this car to spawn. If I can't, then I will show it to you in a future video. I'll be making it on this channel for you guys to see and to look at and to enjoy. Because I like doing these videos. I like, to, I mean, I like doing videos for you guys. Because it makes me 
feel like I've achieved something that makes me feel like that instead of just sitting on my backside doing the game and not earning anything from it currently I'm not, earning, I'm not earning anything but sitting here doing nothing or playing the games that I love and enjoyed I just don't get what I deserve out of it this is why I started this YouTube channel so it'd be greatly appreciated that all the videos I do you watch you subscribe to my channel if you're on the road because I do upload as much as I can but obviously I've got college in the way I've got to do my course I've got the homework I've got to do stuff like that that are fairly important to me and that will help me proceed through life although that I am all my own job is to sit here play record videos for you guys and to enjoy it while I'm doing them I will also hopefully be doing some big big specials and finales and stuff like that in the future for different events and stuff like that hopefully I'm able to hit the events I like uh, that I can feature on YouTube um, like in some and stuff like that I'd love to go to that I like Gamescom as well I'd love to go to Gamescom but obviously I just don't earn enough money and no, I don't earn enough to go to all these events all these things that Shishi was are going to now from today on what I will be doing is I'm gonna, I'm gonna do I'm gonna start doing a few live streams as well but I've already done a few which was on Until Dawn now obviously I've had this channel for about a week and a half so my channel isn't growing well like high as I expected it to be but obviously being a newcomer and everything like that I've still got a lot a lot to learn so it would be great to be appreciated if you just take a few seconds out of your day to click that like button also go to that subscribe button hit it also you push that you push notifications on and turn notifications on so you don't miss one of my daily videos ever again not really daily at the moment but they will be shortly one of these daily videos and also i hope you guys understand that although i am a young age i'm not young i'm almost an adult now and i've only just started this channel but i enjoy like, i enjoy playing every game i enjoy playing most of the games if there's any games you'd like me to play at all within this game make sure you comment in the comment section that or hopefully it will be for because I don't currently have a PC yet but try and comment here for games you would like me to play in the future for further videos I like playing the majority of games I like sitting here I like to into my mates in the process and just kind of just laugh now I do have a lot to learn I've got to admit I do always quite a lot to learn um, I ain't one of these guys that will sit here and just constantly make a video for no reason. I want to do it because I enjoy playing the game. I want to do it because I want to help you guys find out new tricks and new, um, new ways of getting easy money and stuff like that on games like this. I'll be doing quality videos as well. I'm going to be doing some uh, best class setups in the process while I'm playing it. And I will be doing a lot, a lot of... Um, I'll, I'll cut as well, maybe some zombie live stream, get some of them coming in. But other than that, there's not much else to say within this video. Now, I'm going to do my final attempt of trying to get this car to spawn. If it doesn't spawn on this attempt, I will show you guys in a future video what this car or what this car looks like. So, I'm going to do my last lap around the block I'm going to try and get my time here and hopefully this doesn't take the one that's expected so let's see if this car now spawned now my car is busted like I've crashed it a bit but I'm putting my garage going to this is a fair to see it's the final attempt come on please 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 no well, I can't get this car to spawn at all guys, but 
anyway that's gonna be it for today's video i'm sorry that i didn't manage to see i didn't manage to show you guys all the cars that are available that you can find within the game and also the other three cars that i showed in this video i'm so sorry that i couldn't show you this one car this car is the most pain in the ass car to find it's not very very easy to get if you do manage to get your car whilst doing or doing anything mucking around playing a game bring this anything like that make sure you take the screen if you take a picture of it on your phone send it to me via twitter or facebook that i will link hopefully soon in the description that i'll make for this channel and that's going to be it i hope you guys did enjoy it i hope this helps you out about gta 5 i hope this shows you ways of getting the cars or farming these cars just to get a bit of money this is a process that may take some time i will be um honest about that but after a while we will gain some decent cash and you will realize yes this is a very very long process but you can earn some good cash from it currently i've earned 230 k from doing this method it has taken me a lot of time to do it though bear that in mind it is other quick methods out there for gta 5 money and stuff like that but in the part in the future i'll make sure that i do videos on them within this game now that's going to be it i'm sorry that i've rambled on for a lot of this video but i've just i'm half asleep right now i'm really tired i've had a long day that's going to be it i hope you guys did also enjoy why do i keep saying this i do not know smash that like button on this video if you smash that like button i would be greatly greatly appreciated also make sure you hit that subscribe button as well turn that post notifications on while you're at it so you do not miss another another video on my channel also make sure you comment in the comment section down below what games you'd like me to play what uh playthroughs and stuff like that or walkthroughs you want me to play in the future please keep it on ps4 not xbox or pc because i currently do not have any of them at this current stage anyway guys that's going to be it thank you guys for watching and i will see you guys in the next video peace